so example 7 and what is the page number in page number 8 so what is the question a function f x to y is said to be 1 to 1 okay, and not 2 okay the function f2 f from x to y is said to be 1 to 1 and non 2 bijected no 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 you are telling the definition 7 i am talking about example 7 below that okay let sir a be, uh, uh, let, let a be let a be the set of all 50 students of class 10 in a school okay let it's a uh, set of all 50 students sir is it the name roll number anything they mention the set okay, okay. let's assume they are the names okay x1 x2 so on till x50 ah uh. let uh, function a uh, is natural natural number so function from the natural number set to a to natural number set uh. so there is a function that is mapped from this set a to natural number set okay what is that what is that function supposed to satisfy so what is that relation speaking about roll number something they will know what uh, roll number of this story so what is it so that function should be the one minute no uh, let f be a function defined from a to n n is a natural number set which is defined by f of x is equal to roll number of the student so in this case what are they asking show that f to f is one to one but not on to let's concentrate only on one to one next on to forget it so tell me what is one, is it a one to one function or not it's very simple so it's a one one function because you have x1 x2 so on till xn sorry x50 you have 50 students in set a and what do you have on the other side you have the natural number set 1 2 3 so on till you have 50 beyond that also you will have numbers because they didn't say first 50 natural numbers right so if x1 is having the roll number 1 the same x1 cannot have another roll number so to put it simple each person in the role each person in the list is going to have a unique role number associate so for every unique input there is a unique output hence it's a one one function as simple as that. so what you need to write is for every student right for every student there is going to be unique role number associated so for every in, uh, unique uh, input value there is a unique output value hence it's a one one function i hope it is clear no so here we didn't apply that uh, those four steps shall we try next one ah uh. yes sir so this one eight ones so look at the eight problem so what are the eight problem telling us it says there is a function map from natural number set to the natural number set and what does f of x speak about f of x is 2x so what are we supposed to prove so show that it's a one one function but not on right how to do this very simple so by now you would have understood graphically if you see it will be a line passing through the origin it's one one right but we have to show it in the exam no how do we do that consider x1 comma x2 belongs to n what is the second step that we are supposed to assume f of x1 is equal to f of x2 so 2x1 is equal to 2x2 you framed an equation no solve for it so x1 is equal to x2 hence it's a one one function simple but only thing that you need to be careful about is the domain and the codomain because if you see the next problem what are they speak so f is a function map from r to r but here also what is defined f of x is 2x only so what mistake i told you will do we'll take this into consideration but we need to look at the domain and the codomain meaning if you draw the graph for it if at all you draw the graph for it and say this is going to be the graph it is wrong why because only natural number means the input only for natural numbers you will have the points associated meaning how will the graph look like 1 comma 2 2 comma 4 Three comma, it keeps on going like this. Why is it so? Because when you give one as the input, output comes out to be two. Like this, it keeps on going. Basically, this graph is only points. 
whereas this graph is a continuous line you are able to understand same function but the domain and the co domain is changing the whole game right so you will have something like this right so obviously you know the steps x1 comma x2 belongs to this time instead of n it is going to be r so f of x1 is equal to f of x2 so 2x1 is equal to 2x2 cancel 2 and 2 x1 will be equal to and we are done it's simple right so you'll get something like this one right you cannot do you can see if you draw a line so sorry, sorry you can you can do it when you draw a line it is going to cut the curve only at one point it's not a curve at all in the first place it is basically there set of points like but i gave you another way of understanding it what is it i told you every the, the second element in every ordered pair is different so that's how it works you know 2 4 6 it will never get repeat i hope this clear right shall we see what is an onto function because we saw three questions where they asked us about onto also let's try to understand what that onto is so before that i want a confirmation is everyone having clarity about codomain codomain and range no one has confusion no okay shall i proceed